Well, thank you for staying here. If you're just joining us, this is Office of the Citizen. Don't forget, I mean, it's a citizen engagement radio program brought to you by Policy Alert, Youth Alive Foundation, and Enough is Enough Nigeria. Basically, I mean, the aim of this program is to enforce a social contract between the citizen and the government. All right? And don't forget, governance is a collective responsibility. We all have a role to play. We all have a role to play. And if we all play our roles, I mean, Nigeria would become a better country. Nigeria would become a better country. Today on the program, we're focusing on the role of the media and the youth in ending the scourge of COVID-19. As it stands right now, Nigeria has got how many confirmed cases? I'm sure you know already. I mean, we're somewhere within the region of 131 as at yesterday. 131. And if you follow the distribution, I mean, uh, according to the states, the confirmed cases in different states, good enough. I mean, we can say Aquaibon is yet to have a confirmed case of the coronavirus. All right. And so it's important that we're looking at the role the media and the youth can play at this time. I mean, for us, it's preventing the coronavirus from coming into our state. But for some other states right now, I mean, look at the numbers. It should help us, you know, get more serious with what we need to do and why we need to do what we need to do. Lagos, as it stands right now, is the epicenter of the coronavirus in Nigeria. 81 cases confirmed. Uh, the federal capital territory has got 25 confirmed cases. Ogun State has got three confirmed cases. Enugu, two confirmed cases. Ekiti, one confirmed case. Oyo has got eight confirmed cases. Edo State has got two confirmed cases. Bochi has got two confirmed cases. Oshun State has got two. Rivers has got one. Benue, one. Kaduna, three confirmed cases. Now, I mean, at this point, it's pretty obvious. It's all up to us to play a role and make sure that we don't have a reported case in a choir, but we're going to get straight into it this morning. What can the media do once again? What can the youth do, you know, to play a part in making sure that the coronavirus doesn't come into a choir bomb state? And so I'm going to start off. I mean, I told you I've got some gentlemen right here in the studio this morning. I've got uh, Akan James from the Democracy Africa Youth Parliament. He's the chairman, African.